Hi, my name is Andy Wood. I'm Education Director for Audubon North Carolina, and I'm here to talk about how do bluebirds catch their prey. Bluebirds are insectivorous birds, that is, most of their diet is made up of live, small animals, crickets, grasshoppers, caterpillars, beetles, moths, a wide range, a, a wide range of, of insects, and even spiders. Bluebirds are also members of a group of birds known as thrushes, and which includes robins and, and several other species. So bluebirds are insectivorous, that is, their diet is primarily insect matter, um, and they capture their food in a number of different ways. One being kind of unique to the thrush group, and that's called ground sallying. What a bluebird will do is sit on a low perch in a tree or on a fence post and look at the ground for ground-based insects like uh, crickets, grasshoppers, and spiders. When they see one, they'll leave their perch, hop down to the ground, grab the prey, fly back to their put perch where they'll butcher it. They basically kill the insect and then break it into small parts and eat it down. Uh, if they are raising offspring, they'll take the insect back to the nest to feed to their offspring. Um, another way that they, they uh, will obtain food is hovering, again kind of unique for the group of birds known as thrushes. They'll hover over the ground looking for food on the ground. They'll hover around a bush, especially in wintertime when their diet consists of some fruits like blueberries and, and well not so much blueberries, but holly berries and other fruiting trees. Um, but because they're insect eaters, much of their work is conducted in fields where you have lots of insects, and that's why you find bluebirds in open countryside rather than deep forests. And that's how bluebirds catch their food.